Well, summer is a time for kids to have fun and play outside, but two local libraries are making sure kids are still learning. And kids don't have to sit in a classroom. Instead, a big red bus rolls up to keep their brains engaged. I would assume supporter Michaela McDonald spent the day with the mobile newsroom and joins us now with more. A collaboration between two libraries is working to keep children learning in the summer. Each weekday at different schools and recreation centers across Providence, you'll find this big red bus. They know the big red bus. Uh, they see it come outside of their house or outside of their school, uh, and they come running to us. Providence Community Library's mobile library brings books out into the community, making learning more accessible. And we bring the library, but we also bring uh, creative and math activities uh, to all of those students. Neighborhood students, rec center students that are in the camps, and also the camps that are housed in the schools as well. Michelle Johnson brings her five-year-old son Daniel to the mobile library frequently. His favorite part? Lego. He's also learning math in different colors, and they practiced. Um, last time we were here, we were talking about emotions and how do you feel and how it might other people might feel, so they're learning a little empathy. Another summer literacy initiative, now in its fourth year, is the Providence Public Library's Passport to Summer Learning. The research tells us that children can lose two or even three months of math and reading um, in the summer if they're not engaged. Ann Kilkenny is the Early Childhood Services Coordinator for Providence Public Library. She says since starting, they've seen the Passport program grow from 70 to 700 completed at the end of the summer. And that's just one of the ways they're tracking strides made with these programs. We compare reading tests from the spring to reading tests in the fall, and we can see statistically significant maintenance or improvements um, in kids who have participated in, in the program. The mobile library is a completely free program, as is much of the summer passport program. For more information, visit WPRI.com. Michaela McDonald, Eyewitness News.